Welcome back guys, this is Crafty Fox, and welcome to the third part of the Norfolk Southern Training First Responders Train. And uh, this time we are making the tanker car, and this is going to be the last part of this tutorial. It's kind of like a mini-series since it's like three different tutorials. Uh, but thanks again to Cosmic Dune at 4 for a commission this build, and let's get started on the tanker. Now I know in the actual train there's like three different sizes of tankers or I think there is but I'm just gonna be making like this one because it's kind of standard and you can just extend this if you want to so let's begin using hoppers so we're gonna go ahead right here add a hopper skip block another hopper same thing on the other side and then we're gonna take another brick slab add it in between like this and have one, actually two of them stick out like that and maybe one in front of the hoppers then on the sides we're going to use um, iron trap door like this and it's going to be 25 blocks long so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17 18, 19, 20, 22, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. Did I just get confused counting. <laughs> and then the other side, do the same thing. Yep. And I wish they did have like a black trapdoor because this white kind of sticks out a lot, but oh well. All right, and then we're gonna add a hopper in the back. So go over here, skip one away from the edge and add hopper in the middle. And then skip block another hopper and do the same thing both sides. Fill in the gaps in between with nether brick slabs. And then a row on the edge of it and one sticking out. And then we're gonna use, um, another brick fence and then add two blocks tall on the corners like this all right and then we're going to use um what should we do next i guess we'll just use another brick slab and then connect these top part of the fences together And then we would use uh, black wool. So one side is red, one side is black. So I guess we'll just start with this side. So black wool, like that. And make like this T shape. Then we're gonna add a uh, quartz block in the middle on top. Then we're gonna take um, black wool again and Try to make a more bigger plus sign, I would say, uh, behind it. Like that, you try to wanna, you wanna try to extend it like that. Then add in these corner parts. Yeah, that's the shape we're going for. And also, is that another brick slab? Okay, so another brick slab down below here and also another brick slab above here and then on these sides as well we're also going to take um, another brick uh, stairs add that right there down there as well other side same thing and uh, another brick slab down below here as well And then we're going to have to uh, extend this area. I don't know how long this is. But let's say, let's add six blocks to it. So maybe one, two, three, four, five, six. And I guess that's off by one maybe. So one. So that would be seven. So yeah, just extend the rest to match it. And the 
bottom part as well. With the nether brick fence, I mean nether brick slabs go along. Then the stairs, how are we going to do this? Like this. I guess it's good to make it hollow. Then black wool sticking out on the sides. And actually, I think it might be better to place the black wool first so that you have something to put on your stairs. Or rather, something <laughs> you put the stairs on. Alright, and the last one right here, I guess. Then we're uh, pretty much going to do a similar thing in the front. So uh, we're going to take out uh, red concrete. Go over here, add a T-shape. And above in the middle, add quartz block. And then we're going to add another plus sign right behind it, but longer. The red, like this. Then add red in these corner pockets, making it more circular. And then we're going to use acacia wood slab. Add it above that uh, <laughs> quartz block, also on the sides. Then we're going to take acacia wood stairs, fill in these parts, also the bottom as well. And the bottom of this is actually black, so uh, we'll have to change that up a little bit. So add another brick slab right there. And then we're going to take a black wool and then extend this. Actually get rid of this red right there and then replace it with black wool. Extend it all the way to the other side. So I think the bottom of this is all black. So we're going to take um, another brick slab. Add it right under here. Connect the two together. Like that. And then for the next layer, <laughs> I don't know how long this is again. Hmm. I would say looks like 10 blocks long, so add 10 blocks of red. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Okay, I was off by one again, so 11. And it doesn't really matter since there's only a gap between them. So we're going to take out yellow terracotta, add that in between. Because there is like this yellow line that divides the red and the black. And then we're going to take oak wood slab, add it on the sides of it. Then we're going to take acacia wood slab and fill in this top section all the way. And then we're going to go ahead and add this, this little cage right here. So we're going to take another brick uh, fence, three blocks wide, just in front of the yellow. And then add dark oak fence gate right here, so it can actually go inside. And then um, two more another brick uh, fences, I mean. I was going to say stairs, but no. And then connect the two, so it kind of looks like this. We're also going to take black wool, put that right there, like a little cap, I think. And then we're going to go ahead and then add, you should probably just add the, like the words first. So I'm going to take uh, quartz, add two blocks here, red, two more quartz, then two reds, and then uh, the yellow terracotta. The other side, I think it's a little bit different. So for the other side, I'm just going to make it all red with the terracotta right there at the end. We'll fix it up later. So then we're going to add uh, acacia wood stairs. Add that right over here. 
and on top of the yellow. And then we're going to add black wool after the yellow part. That, try to connect that together and then we're going to take um, Oakwood stairs at three blocks right here and then the one after it is nether brick should be the same thing on the other side all right so then um, gonna add like this ladder part so that's gonna line up with the fence gate so we're just going to take a uh, black wool and try to extend this part so it reaches down and touches the iron trap door. We're also going to take ladder and actually place that right there so you can kind of get up there. Same thing on the other side, line it up with the fence gate, go down to the iron trap door and then add the ladders. Alright, so then we're going to take... Um, Another brick stairs, fill that gap in. And add two blocks over here as well. So that should be two on each side. And the rest of this, it looks like uh, an oak wood stair, so we'll fill that in. And this side. And then uh, we can also add like the color decorations, which we're going to do. So add uh, quartz on the sides of the back, I believe. And this is actually two blocks long on this side. There also is going to be a gray concrete block. And that's going to be four blocks of space between that. And the quartz block, so right here. The other side. I think this might be the same, or maybe not. But anyways, this is like a gap of four again, but this one's two blocks long, so maybe it's not the same as the other side. So I just place that yellow in there, which is yellow concrete. And on the side, we're also gonna take gray concrete. Skip these two reds put that right there. On the very edge we're going to add uh, the quartz right there. Yeah it's starting to come together. We can also take out um, another brick uh, stairs and how <laughs> you know where to place it. Three blocks. Okay so this is I think it's a bit arbitrary where I put it but hmm it is three blocks away from the ladder it looks like and then two blocks of space between both of them so skip three trap doors place one right there away from the ladder of course and then skip two put one there go right here skip three put one skip two add one so pretty much three and then two three and then two three and then two that was a weird cave noise we're also going to take a uh, black carpet, fill that in on top of the iron trap door to make it less uh, white, which we don't want. And then the other side, do the same thing. Alright, and then we can also... Is that even possible? <laughs> I guess you can cover this up if you don't want, really want that showing. But I don't know, maybe you, you do like these hoppers. But I know in my original one I didn't cover up, but maybe so this may look a little better. Just cover up these hoppers. All right, so let's take an inspection because I think we're pretty much done with this. And it looks like we are done. So yeah, that's how you build the Norfolk Southern Training First Responders Safety Train uh, Tanker Car. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and thanks again to Cosmic Donut 4 for commissioning this build. If you guys like this video, please hit that like button below, and subscribe if you haven't already, because I will be uploading more videos like this 
in the future, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.